Hi guys Sportsia News Briefs. Cristiano Ronaldo says Saudi League is better than MLS in Lionel Messi swipe. Al Nasser forward Cristiano Ronaldo said the Saudi Pro League is better than Major League Soccer and that he has no plans to play in the United States or return to a team in Europe. Ronaldo was speaking to the media after playing the first half of Al Nasser's 5-0 preseason friendly defeat to La Liga side Celta Vigo in his native Portugal. The Saudi league is better than MLS, Ronaldo said when asked about whether he'd consider a move to the United States like his great rival Lionel Messi, who was unveiled as an Inter Miami player on Now All the Players Are Coming Here, Ronaldo said. In one year, more top players will come to Saudi Arabia. Ronaldo, who was substituted at half-time with the score tied 0-0, added, I opened the way to the Saudi league, and now all the players are coming here. Several high-profile players have followed Ronaldo to Saudi Arabia, including Ballon d'Or winner Karim Benzema from Real Madrid and Nagolo Kante from Chelsea, who both joined champions Al Ittihad. The 38-year-old Portugal captain, who joined Al Nasser in December on a two-and-a-half-year contract following his exit from Manchester United, said he had paved the way for other top players to sign with Saudi teams and that more would make the move to the Desert Kingdom. I'm 100% sure I won't return to any European club. I'm 38 years old, ESPN quoted him as saying. Carlos Alcaraz joins prestigious list including Federer, Djokovic, Nadal, Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo. After claiming the prestigious Wimbledon trophy, Carlos Alcaraz is getting another honor for his achievement in the form of a Catalan nativity figurine. With this he will join a list of athletes that include Roger Federer, Novak Djokovic, Lionel Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo and many more. Carlos Alcaraz is on cloud nine after capturing his second Grand Slam title, for which he beat four-time defending champion Djokovic in the final. With this title he has not only consolidated the top rank in men's tennis, but has also secured a spot in the ATP finals. The Spanish ace, moving forward, will be focused on defending his US Open title. Erling Haaland sends immediate reminder to inspire Man City comeback win in thrilling friendly. Erling Haaland needed just six minutes to show why he's big in Japan. Manchester City boss Pep Guardiola gave the 61,618 fans in Tokyo's National Stadium what they had come to see by sending on the goal machine as a half-time substitute after seeing his side hit back from two goals down against the Japanese champions to go in at the break on level terms. And last season's 52-goal sensation needed just three touches of the ball to find the back of the net from Phil Foden, s raking pass. Haaland scored again in injury time, arriving at the far post to walk home Joao Cancelo's brilliant low cross. It certainly sent the punters home happy. Galatasaray to sign Wilfried Zaha. Galatasaray confirmed talks have started to sign Wilfried Zaha on free transfer. Negotiations are advanced as Zaha could be next signing after Bakambu. Crystal Palace offered him record new deal but Gala are pushing to get it done. Harvey Barnes joins Newcastle. Harvey Barnes joins Newcastle on £38 million deal from Leicester. Contract until June 2028. Marco Silva has rejected huge €40 million Euros deal. Marco Silva has rejected huge €40 million Euros two-year deal proposal from Saudi side Al Ali. Portuguese coach has decided to stay at Fulham, showing his commitment once again despite two big Saudi proposals. Fulham are closing deal to sign Raul Jimenez from Wolves. Fulham are closing in on £5.5 million deal to sign Raul Jimenez from Wolves, here we go soon. Agreement imminent between the two clubs. Raul accepted, medical could take place early next week. For more sports news please visit our Twitter handle or YouTube channel Sportsia.